God has blessed us with the words of Matthew 5, 9. Blessed are the peacemakers. Heri wapatanishi. I have just come from a trip in Nyanza. And it is amazing what God can do. You know, it is almost a miracle that the people who were on extreme sides a few months ago, today, we are speaking as though we are very long time brothers and sisters and friends. And that is the beauty of our country. That is the beauty of our country. That when circumstances demand, we close ranks as a people, we forge alliances as a people, we build bridges as Kenyans, and we work together for the greater good of our nation. And I want to encourage and promise us as Kenyans that those who want to divide us will fail, and they will fail miserably. <laughs> those who want to preach to us sectarian, ethnic, parochial, regional politics will not succeed in this country because this country is a country that trusts in God and all of us are children of the same God. And so every leader, those of us who have the privilege to be leaders in Kenya at whatever level, we must understand, we must appreciate that we are leaders for the people of Kenya. And it doesn't matter, just like Lusaka here, he was not voted for everybody in Bungoma. Yeah? Almost 40% of the people did not vote for him, but he's the governor for Bungoma, all the people of Bungoma, and he must work for all the people of Bungoma. And I also promise that I will work for all the people of Kenya without discrimination, without exclusion, because that is what is demanded of government by the Constitution, and I am perfectly aware that it is also the will of God to work with everybody, to work for the people of Kenya in their entirety, in their unity. And I want to promise Kenyans that I will go out of my way. I will do whatever it takes to make sure that this country is united and that no part of Kenya is left behind as we march into the future as a people. It is our collective responsibility as leaders to walk in that manner. I know some people you know, ask questions. What happens to us? Those of us in Bungoma who eh, voted overwhelmingly for this administration, we may ask, what happens to us? We can see Atandi and all the other people are, you know, surging into this place, what happens to us? I want to tell you that this country, God designed it in a way that all of us can belong. And whatever is in Kenya, if we work together, we can bake a bigger cake that all of us can be satisfied. So nobody should worry about the unity of Kenya. In fact, if there is any worry, it is not the unity of Kenya. It is the disunity, if at all.